my art is a lot about pausing, slowing yourself down. It's an opportunity to think about who you are and why and how you act. And it's so important in life to pause. When I create, it's almost like a meditation. It's a lot about where you are at and where you want to go next or where you've been and how you want to improve that, you know. So it's a lot about that. For several years I was working as a consultant and it was stressful in that way that like you had to wear a costume and I hated that, that aspect because it was so regimented and people would judge you on what you looked and not what you were doing. Like every morning you'd get up at 6.30, 7 o'clock in the morning, sometimes a bit earlier, and then you would go on the job. But it was not a passion. It was, it was interesting, but not a passion. And, and that's probably why I, I left this type of, of jobs later on. I never thought ever that I would be able to, to be a visual artist, like a professional one. The values that I, I care for are um, there is respect, respect of the of the environment, uh, respect of the others. I, I, I like to be able to feel the world and and I, and being able to mold the world to make my dreams happen and share them to people. That's what I like. Nature carries us, carry carries me as a human. Um, it's the closest to the skin that I that makes my body. You know, like we are made of of water. When you're in nature, you can smell, you can touch so many different things. You can feel the air, even though like is it, like you feel almost an energy in nature that you don't get in cities in a different ways through the combination of you know like the, the rough texture of the the bark. Uh, the wind that's blowing and making noise through the, through the leaves, the light that is coming through the, the trunks of the, the forest and, and lighting specific areas. Like all those combinations of those items in nature make, make it like so um, new every day. It helps you to connect with what allows us to, to live. The air, the light, uh, and the water, it, it's, it's being part of the cycle of life and death again. I'm like everybody else. I like I like to feel that I, I can f affect people. Um, it's it's very presumptuous to think that you change people that you that uh, that 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 you have this ability. People come come regularly to to say like yeah you're, I remember doing something with you or seeing something that you've done with me or, or, or I've seen your pieces and I was touched by it. Um, I, I love that, that because it means that I've touched somebody and then like, so that person can touch me in, in return. That's what I, I, I'm hoping for. And also it's like, it makes me cry. It's like, um, just because it's very deep, because I, I really believe that um, those connections have to happen in order to improve the world that we are in. My art is one way that I feel I can, I can use to change the way people will feel and indirectly I, I'm hoping to change the world a little bit through that. That's my, my hope. <laughs>